Hello, and welcome to this tutorial. It's not really a Brawl Box tutorial, but I'm going to have to classify it as one because it's really just the fundamentals of an upcoming idea that will be very, very crucial in your Brawl Box modding. I'm going to call this tutorial Full Moveset Swapping because that's really what we're doing. This is so basic, anyone with half a brain can do it. But really, I, I'm going to try to teach you what is going on so you can understand it later when we're doing it in, in much more specific context. So navigate to your SD card. Uh, quickly get your way to Fighter. And we're going to do this to Kirby. Then now navigate to where you have your effects. And if you don't have this, I have uploaded it to Rapid Share. And that is in downloading of all necessary files for PSA, and I also have that one for Brawlbox. So, find fitkoopamotion.pack and copy that into Kirby's file. Right click, rename fitkirbymotion.pack. Now when the game loads, it's going to try to do all of Bowser's animations for Kirby. If you can think of it this way, it will really help you in the future. All of the bones inside of Bowser were animated, not the actual skin of Bowser. So you could put Bowser's bones into Kirby, which is what we're doing right now, so Kirby will stretch to look like Bowser, and then the bones will do the animation, stretching the model around it. So later we'll be able to do this for some moves, so it only stretches then. And we'll try to look at ways to reduce the amount of stretchage to make it look more natural. But be warned that because, remember in the dot pack, not the fit motion, is all your articles. So if you try to do Bowser's Fire, I'm pretty sure it's going to freeze. Same thing if you did... Falcon Punch, uh, Mario's Fireball, anything like that. So this is really just to think of it in a way. Really try to imagine that you're taking someone's bones and shoving them inside of the model and making it fit, and the animations are running, and the model's just stretching around the animations. If you can get your head around this, you can really... You'll understand what I'm talking about when we get much more specific and much more advanced, which happens very quickly in Brawlbox. Uh, thank you very much for watching this tutorial. And as you'll see in the demonstration, which will be in the description, uh, it's a lot of fun, really easy, and really funny. So thank you again for watching this.